boy. Are you your animal ahead? I knew it was a boy. Shoot when you're ready. Remember, draw to your chest. Wild boar's hide is thick. But I hit it, didn't I? I did what you said and it looked like it bounced off. Could the boar be magical? Hmm. What do you think? It looked weirder than any boar I've ever seen. Get after it then. Stay alert. More of those people? Something else. Bodies are those weird dead things. <laughs> There's Draugr here, too. Under. Steady hand, relax. Accuracy over speed. Yes! Oh, do not lose it. Dress. He's going down. The dress. What did you do? I'm sorry. The dress. Ugh, <sighs> ugh, 
We didn't know he belonged to anyone. He doesn't. He's my friend. The boy was following my command. Then help fix this. Hold here, please. Hold, I said. He's losing blood. The last of his kind in all the realm, and you shoot him. You needed food? Target practice. Target practice. I'm I'm so, so sorry. Keep that pressure on. The blame is mine. Should have kept a closer eye. Will he die? I will not let him. You. The arrow cut a tideway inside him. Find both ends and hold them tightly. Start with the left side. Grab it and hold. Now the right side. Hold it good. Now pull them together. Line them up. So now... You're a witch. I can't finish the healing here. My home is just beyond the trees there. You will carry him. He must not die. Good. He seems stable and calm for now. Grey This way. That bow's a little big for you, isn't it? My mother made it for me. Said I'd grow into it. I've never seen you in these woods. She must miss you being away from home. She... She's dead. We're taking her ashes to the highest peak in the realms. Ashes? It was her last wish. Boy. I'm... Sorry for your loss. We're here. You live in a tree? Not in it. Below it. Hemile! Look! It's alright. Is he friendly? Boy. I promise you, he's safe. You won't hurt anyone. Him on the stave there. Keep him still. You live alone? It's better this way. Yeah, my father doesn't like people either. Boy. Well, you don't. Hold him still before he hurts himself. Good. Shh. Easy. Rest now. I need two more things. Fresh red root grows just behind the house. Can you pull a cluster? What else? I... I know you're a god. Not of this realm, but there's no mistaking it. He doesn't know, does he? About your true nature? Or his own? That is none of your concern. The gods of these realms don't take kindly to outsiders, trust me. I know. When they find you, and they will, they'll make things difficult. The boy will want answers. That will be my problem. Whatever you're hiding, you cannot protect him forever. But you're right. Doesn't concern me.
I also need lamb's crass. Do you mind? It's a white petal flower in my garden. Just a handful. Fine. Lamb's crass. Would this help? I dropped it? When you were chasing the animal. What's wrong with me? If I... If I lost it then... You did lose it. I'll take better care of it from now on. So he's gonna live? Yes. Then we are leaving. Wait. Not without thanks. You want solitude? This mark will hide you from... those who might make your journey difficult. There's a shortcut below the house that leads safely out of these woods. Follow this path down, then head towards daylight. Will we see you again? As much or as little as you like. Now get out of here. Come, boy. This underground passage should put you back on your path to the mountain. Just use the boat. Wait, and take this. You can use it to orient yourself and navigate the world. It will always steer you towards your goals. I see a boat! Mom used to tell me about them. Didn't think they were actually real. 
Nightmares. Yeah. They give people nightmares. Or they are nightmares. I don't remember which. I wish I could ask. Touch the water. Why? Do you know what is under the surface? No. It's pitch black. Then do not touch the water. We'll get to the mountain quick. I just can't believe I'm here. In all of this. There was a time I thought I'd never leave our woods. Or even my own bed sometimes. You are not to blame for your sickness. Oh, I know. I guess I'm just saying. This is great. There's the mountain. Look how close we are. We flow into seawater. How do you know? Do you not smell it? If that smells the sea, the sea stinks. Look at that! It's Thor! Thor, god of thunder. That's right! I never thought you'd listen when Mother spoke of the gods. I seldom did. Did she speak of one who could feel no pain? Oh. That sounds like Baldur. Baldur. An Aesir god. Son of Odin and Frigg. And Odin is king. That's right. Why do you ask? I see rooms there. In his chest. Can't quite make it out. It reads, sacrifice your arms to the center of the water. Awaken again the cradle of the world. What? Throw our weapons into the water? Guess that won't be a problem for you. Are you gonna do it? Is this? 
this. It's the World Serpent! way over there. See that? And there's a statue of Thor. Except I can see a lot more of him now. The water dropped and the serpent rose. Oh, that must be why the beach wasn't there before. See? And there's the mountain. Look it. That building leads from the foot of the mountain to that golden temple. It was all just under the surface. Except for the statue. Good thing, huh? There's even a dock. There, next to the flag. We're going to the dock first, right? We'll be the first people to walk on it, and who knows how long. You know that serpent? He's one of the giants. He's so big, he's wrapped around the whole world and bites his own tail. An exaggeration. I don't know. Looked pretty big to me. How long do you think this has been here? A very long time. Is this the way to the mountain? It would seem. If it isn't the bearded beaver, it is sack seed. Have I got something for you too? Brock? But how did you... None of your fucking business. Now get in here, I got something for you. And don't go making pig eyes at my spot. I saw it first. Okay. What do you think he wants? To test our patience. When word gets out about my new shop, folks will finally come out of hiding. They'll be clawing all over each other just to catch a whiff of my wares. You watch. You rust around like that everywhere? Yeesh! Catch! The pile of rocks there? With that key of Yggdrasil, you can open a magic door to the branches of the World Tree. A shortcut between the realms. If you ever see them out in the world, Use it to get back to me quick. But it's only one way. Straight back here and nowhere else. And whatever you do, never, never, ever, never, ever throw yourself over the edge of the path, lest you want death. Yeah, I don't see us wanting that. Sure, I'm open. Make you something? 
What'd you forget? Best of luck with all the rampaging. Let's sort you out. Hope you got what you wanted. <laughs> Ready your self. I'm ready. Hmm. I don't know these rooms. If we find a cipher, I bet I could figure it out. Show me more focus. Look here. Another. Look! It's the World Serpent. 
He's so much bigger than I imagined. Oh, look! He bit Thor! Or will bite him. Looks like. I still can't read these. What is that? It smells awful. It's a fragment of a language cipher. We should look for more like this. Oh, what were those things? They smelled awful. Your mother called them scorn poles. Poison magic. She was the one who showed me how to disable them. <laughs> what? It's just funny to think of her teaching you something. Yes. Whoa. Sure is foggy here. Another dwarf. Should we... No. He is of no consequence. Uh, excuse me, but, um, how did you come by that, uh, axe? That is my concern alone. And, uh, while I won't dispute that, I, I know that blade. It was one of ours, but, uh, <laughs> we didn't make it for you. Step aside. I can't. See, the woman we made it for, I was, uh, well, I am quite fond of her, and I would be somewhat... Displeased if it turns out that you did something to her. It was my mother's. She left its father before she died. Face dead? I'm very, very sorry to hear that. She was a fierce warrior and a good woman. Okay, I will make improvements to the axe. But nobody asked you to. Well, it's, it's true, but... But knowing your mother, <laughs> she would have insisted I repair that act of vandalism perpetrated against her axe by my brother. I knew it. You are Brock's brother. The other half of the brand's here. The blue one is your brother. Yes. Though my talents are vastly superior. <laughs> no boast. I swear to Freya. <gasps> Do not undo his work. Improve upon it only. Yeah, but can you can you put it down over there? That handle is No. There? Filthy. Okay, then. I'll just... I will just... Oh. 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 Oh, is that dried blood? Oh. So, what were you working on? Oh, that. 
I call it the sky mover. Just up that mountain waits a treasure trove of rare resources. Once I mine it, I'll need a way to bring it all down. And you know how to fix it? Not even a little. Oh, I could use a distraction. No, we can't forget you! Don't forget to wash your hands! Atreus here. Yes, father. You think all dwarves are as weird as Brock and Sindri? No. Wonder why they don't get along anymore. I mean, they're family. That is their matter alone, boy. Okay.
can't tell. Are we getting closer to the mountain? We are. Prepare yourself! Do you think for this last leg up the mountain that maybe I can carry her? I told you no. Why? She meant more to me than you anyway. What? I, I just meant I spent more time with her. You were off hunting a lot. It would serve you to stop talking. <laughs>
I can see why Mom wanted us to bring her here. Indeed. Hmm. What do we need here? Smoke? I'm exhausted. Stay back, boy. Ugh. What is that? We must find another way up. The witch! Wish she was here. Bet she could get us past this. My magic is useless against the Black Breath, and there's no way around it. Odin saw to that long ago. What are you doing here? Making sure you can finish your journey. Why wait to warn us? I was busy, saving my friend, if you remember. Hmm. The Black Breath is a corruption of magic even I can't dispel. Only the pure light of Alfheim is strong enough to break through. But that road is long. What does this goal mean to you? It's everything. Follow me. Why help us? 
Maybe I see more of myself in you than I'm willing to admit. Maybe. Maybe by helping you I'll make up for a lifetime of mistakes. Or maybe I just like you. Even though we shot your friend? Even though you shot my friend, yes. Hmm. Where must we go? To a realm beyond your own. Going to another realm? Are you coming with us? Only for a little while. Only for a little while. We'll use this. Graythar. Can't. Sindri said it was broken. Sindri? The dwarf at the foot of these hills. He was fixing it when we got here. Well, no one was there when I passed by. Perhaps he finished. Dwarves are awfully resourceful. And irritating, based on the two we have met. <laughs> that too. <laughs> Just give that a turn. There. See? Tyr's temple is at the center of the lake. It is from there we travel to Alfheim. Thankfully, it's no longer underwater. Why is that creature in the bay? No one knows. He just appeared one day. Soon after, Thor attacked and their battle could be felt across all the realms. Ultimately, it ended in a stalemate, and Thor returned to Odin empty-handed. The serpent stayed and grew so large, he now spans all of Midgard. See? Told you. They've hated each other ever since. Destined to kill each other come Ragnarok. You believe in Ragnarok? I dearly wish I didn't, child. You know, we actually talked to the World Serpent. You did? An exaggeration. I'm good with languages, even ones I've never heard before. But when he talks, I can't understand any of it. Sadly, no one can. He speaks a dead tongue. Oh. Must be lonely. Watch your step. Just along here. Are you sure? We came through here before and there's no way back across. See? Is that so? Let me show you something. Are you watching? Leosa! What? It's solid! Elven architecture. My bowstring was soaked in the light of Alfheim. It can now reawaken the magic of the elves. Wait, it won't just disappear, will it? Not as long as the light shines free. This way. I want one. Those roots. What kind of magic is that? It's Vanir. From Vanaheim? You know of it? Just stories. Mother didn't say much about the Vanir gods. Just like they were at war with the Aesir. As compared to Odin and Thor. They're the good guys. There are no good gods, boy. Thought I taught you that. Tyr's temple. Built with help from the giants, Great Tyr used it to travel the Nine Realms and keep the peace between them. Doesn't seem very peaceful. Everywhere we go, we're attacked. Especially by dead things. The risen dead grow ever more numerous. <laughs> the roads and trails would have been full of people. Now all have hid or fled, save for the Reavers, savage enough to survive in such a world.
Make a ride at the bottom of these stairs. Hey, another one of those light crystals. Wait there while I reawaken the light. Leosta. That did it. What are we doing exactly? Mending the disrepair. Start by lifting that axle. Good. Now push it back into place. Now realign the wheel onto the track. Perfect. Now push the bridge along the track. What? The whole entire bridge is turning. How is the whole entire bridge turning? Boy, you're really strong. Just keep pushing until the bridge reaches its first position. Tired yet? No. He's always been really strong. So about the dead, we heard someone call them Hellwalkers. But what are they? They are poor, restless souls, denied their judgment and their peace. By what? Could Vanier magic raise the dead? It could, once. But this is no spell. This plague of dead is but a symptom of a world out of balance. Something or someone has meddled with powerful forces. That is all I know for sure. That's perfect. Come back up. We're ready now. That was impressive. You didn't hurt your back, did you? I did not hurt my back. Through these doors. Wait, so did the Giants or the Elves build Tear Stump? All the races helped with its construction. It was the last great act of cooperation between the realms before peace disappeared for good. Leosta. Your bowstring stopped glowing. Its power is now depleted. Only a few knocks of magic remained in the bowstring and we used them. Your bow, please. Once you claim the light of all time, infuse the bowstring with its power. Don't forget. Talk like you're not coming with us. I'll try, but measures were taken to keep me trapped in Midgard. Why? The gods don't care for me much. Is this it? It's so dark. This temple has been asleep, underwater for almost 150 winters. It needs only the light of the Bifrost to reawaken. Those roots don't look like your magic. They aren't. These roots are part of the Great World Tree, and make travel between the realms possible. How does it work? You will need this, a Bifrost, to create travel between realms. It can capture, hold, and transfer the Light of Alfheim. Place the Bifrost there. What now? Give it a moment. The temple needs time to wake up from its long slumber. It is from this room, and this room alone, that you will be able to cross between realms. What you see before you represents the temple in which we stand, as well as the realm towers that encircle the Lake of Nine outside. All the realms exist in the same physical space, reflections of each other. These doors, the towers outside, and the Nine Realms are all intertwined and coexisting on the branches of the World Tree, separated only by the Bifrost Light of Alfheim. This place can focus and control that light. 
And is this the World Tree? Only an artistic representation of it. No, the Yggdrasil is much, much more than this. The Tree of Life is bound to the fate of the world, just as we are bound to it. The tree nourishes our soils. The dew from its leaves feeds our valleys and rivers. The tree's very existence supports all of creation along its boughs. Its life energy interwoven into the tapestry of life. Birth, growth, death, and rebirth. Every strand transcending time, transcending space. Everything comes back to the tree. So, that's how it works. But I'm guessing you were looking for a more practical answer. Yes. Very well. The bridge you pushed outside is currently positioned to lead to the realm of Vanaheim. Instead, turn the wheel to our actual destination, Alfheim. Wait, is this moving the big bridge outside? Yes, the wheel turns the bridge, and the bridge aligns to the different realm towers on the lake outside. Wait, there's no tower on this one. And that's why realm travel to Jotunheim is impossible. Without a tower for the bridge to lock into, the sequence can't begin. Every realm has a travel rune that unlocks the bridge to that realm. I'm giving you the one for Alfheim. Now you can lock in your destination. We're ready. Remember to take the Bifrost. You don't want to lose that. Now the realm travel bridge will align, and the realm between realms will open. See that giant crystal? Each realm has a corresponding one that focuses and amplifies the power of the Bifrost, opening the bridge to that realm. That's why realm travel is only possible from this room. What about that one realm tower missing from the lake? The Jotunheim Tower disappeared from all realms over a hundred winters ago, when the giants vanished from Midgard. Where the tower went and how they moved it remain a mystery. Follow me. But my frost is dark. This trip was its last use. There's no going back until it's replenished with the light of Alfheim. So we are trapped. Someone of your ability should have little trouble getting back to Midgard. And we'll be able to make that black breath go away? With the captured light of Alfheim, yes. Welcome to Alfheim, gentlemen. Think you can spot... The light. I can barely see it. Something's wrong. See that column of light on the horizon? It's housed in the heart of a ring temple. We'll find what we need there. No. No, no, no. Damn it, not yet. What's happening? <sighs> to restore the Bifrost magic, you must step into the light. But be very careful not to get your body. Hmm. She's not dead. Is she? Not likely. Come. Look at this place. Stay by me. Touch nothing. Okay. What is that? I think you killed it. Whoa, what's that about? Not our concern, boy. Focus. Look here. What does it say? Hmm. Something about an eternal war for the light. I don't get it. Both sides need it. 
Why not just share it? Greed. You'll find it a common cause for war. They keep murdering the White Elves. It is war. The end of one. The rope one's lost. Oh. I'll knock him down! attacking us for. We didn't do anything. <laughs> More will come. Uh. Where's this stuff even come from? <laughs> yeah! Did you say something? No. Oh, okay. I'll see what I can fit together. At least we're getting closer to the light. Huh. Wait, was that Sindri? Yes, yes, come in! Hey, you uh, probably shouldn't let my brother lay his hands on again, but if he does, tell him to temper his steel longer. He's warping the bit work. Travel safe, you two. Atreus, follow me. Let's get started then.
If you're not in a hurry. How are you here before us, Dwarf? We were told our path was the only one between realms. Well, it may be the only way for you to travel, but we dwarves are full of surprises. That is not an answer. Ah, hang on to that sense of wonder. There's so little mystery once you've amassed the wealth of arcane knowledge that I have. Where to comb the realms for exotic resources. How to craft them into creations that defy imagination. To the novice, I'm sure it all seems like magic, but... Uh, oh, all right. It's magic. Are you happy now? Did you really make that axe for my mother? Oh, I'd recognize it anywhere. Ask me. It's one of our best. Infused with the echoing screams of 20 frost trolls. Give or take. But why her? How did you know her? She sought us out in the beginning. She was a special woman. She wanted to protect people. I suppose we thought it was a chance to give power to someone who'd use it for good. She even spoke our native tongue. She'd say, Madhurin Sem Gengur, Egen Vigum Hans. Gengur I. That's right. That's impressive. I see a lot of her in your eyes. You know? Thanks, and Don't I... touch me! What? I didn't. I won't. I'll come back later. Be careful where you're going. There's nobody nice out here anymore since all the people left. I mean, I hate to generalize, but um, mostly they just try to kill you. Good tip. What'd you say? I said nothing. Really? Okay. Did your mother speak of this realm? Not much. Just that since the elves are always fighting over the light, they kept them isolated. said nothing. Weird. Could have sworn you said something. Ah! Ah! What is it, boy? Oh. <clears throat> Voices! You don't hear that? I hear nothing. <clears throat> it's going away now. It was screaming. Lots of voices. Angry. You really didn't hear that? No. It felt... Evil. Look, should we try talking to them? No. But maybe they need help. They do not stop us, so they do not concern us. They Maybe. do not concern us. Look at that. That must be the Ring Temple. They have sand bowls in Alfheim too.
what does it ask? Without me or within me, death is sure. Yet within you, I am life most pure. But I don't see any runes around here. Oh, we must find it. Back to the boat. Sad the elves can't work things out. How if I'm such a beautiful place? But the blue door! That's gotta be the entrance. Let's go! Careful, boy. What are they doing? The bridge is gone. They covered the crystal with that stuff. Why? To prevent reinforcements. Maybe we can fix the bridge from down there? Okay, so that did something. I think. Right Combined together like that, they kind of look like a rune. It doesn't make sense. Come, back to the sand bowl. The elves can't work things out. How if I'm such a beautiful place? But war makes it ugly. Enough. Stories are for the boat. We must focus. Father! The pillars and ring form an elvish rune. 
draw it. Boy! It was the voices again, but different voices, less angry. They were asking for help. We are here for the light. I do not care who they are, nor what they want. You never care about anything. You have something to say? No. Luger. What's happening? Whoa! Look what we found! Father? Yes? The voices I heard, uh, it was hard to make out, but way in the back I'm pretty sure I heard Mother. That is not possible. But I know what I heard. Atreus, enough. He looks different. Look at those horns. Behind me, boy. That can't be good. Stay away from those cages. Wonder why they're locked up. Be ready. What? worth it.
Okay. Tricky. Very tricky. Think that side hallway will get us to the temple? We will find out. You were wrong back there. Oh? I know Mother's voice better than any. It was her. She is gone, boy. Speak no more of this. Fine.
No way across here. Too bad the witch's bowstring doesn't work anymore. Oh! Hey, you sure the witch is okay? I'd hate to think she died helping us. She knew what she was doing. Okay. Ugh, more of it. If we cut enough away, the bridge above us should reappear. Right. Expect resistance. Right. Yeah. <laughs> 
feel my fingers after that one. Well, there it is. Watch our backs, boy. 